Tom Davis, Rick Dempsey, and joined now by Floyd Rayford. Used to play for the Orioles back in the 80s and uh, had a good time playing for the Birds. You had a lot of fun, I think, back in those days. Tom, I had a great time playing for the Orioles. <laughs> and, you know, I wish I could do it all over again. <laughs> but I had a great time playing for the Orioles. But, I'd, I'd love to see you again. I'll tell you what. you gotta, you got to move back to Baltimore again. You can't be down in Florida. People love you here, Rafe. I know. You know, uh, ever since I've been here, it's just been – you know, such a warm reception. Everything's been great. Um, I bring a lot of runs with me. I told um, I told him the other day that we were going to score a lot of runs when I came into town the other day because it's all the runs that I, I, I didn't use. So I had a lot of left over runs. So when I come to town, we score a lot of runs. <laughs> You'll be Buck's shadow for the rest of the season. <laughs> How about back in 85 when you hit the 18 home runs? You had a great story about why you had the home run increase that season. Why? Well, you know, um, really, I didn't. I didn't play. Uh, I didn't play much in April and May, and um, I played mostly in June and July, and had 18 home runs. And it was a funny story about that. Um, I played a couple of games, and Earl said um, that if I had got a hit off of Dave Steve, that he would play me for the rest of the year. <laughs> and I knew I only had three at bats to work with. So the first at bat, Steve <laughs> struck me out on five pitches. The second at bat, he struck me out on four pitches. So the third at bat, I said to myself, if I don't get a hit, I know Earl's going to pinch hit for me that fourth at bat. So he got me 0-2, and I said, oh, Lord, he's going to strike me out on, on three pitches. <laughs> I guess he needed a laugh. He threw me an inside fastball. He busted my bat. And I guess the Lord is just a, a man of not many words. Somebody said run. And so I run, and it was a little looper over the second baseman's head, over Donald So Garcia's head. It fell in. That was my hit. Earl played me the rest of the year, and I hit the 18 home run. <laughs> if I hadn't got that hit, he wouldn't have played me no more. Uh, Sugar Bear, where did I, I got to find out. I know that you were nicknamed after a cartoon character on a cereal box. I can't, I can't remember what cereal box it was. What, what cereal was it? The Post Super Sugar Crisp Bear. The Sugar oh, Crisp Bear. Okay. That's Post the Super one. Sugar Crisp Bear. And they always said I look like that guy. You ain't got that body you know, anymore, man. I feel You're like looking I, good, Rafe. I feel like I got that body different. <laughs> I really do. You told I, me you were married three times now. Yes. How can any woman give up on that? I, I, I have no idea, but believe me, two of them did. <laughs> Floyd, how about your days with Ripken and, and uh, some of the things that transpired you with your re yeah, with wrestling that. matches and uh, pitching and batting practice and things like that? Well, you know something I got to tell you. He was basically al always my protector. Real? Yep, yes, he I was. was. <laughs> he was always my protector. The only time... Uh, there was time Lee Lacey was getting on me on the bus. Oh, gosh. <laughs> and, then, and then, I guess, Demper afterwards went to his room. And after that, Lee Lacey didn't get on me anymore. <laughs> so I don't know what Demper did to him. But he hey, didn't get but you there. remember what happened. Lee Lacey and I got in a little fight. Yeah. And he got a few knots put on him, something yeah. around his head. Oh, yeah. And that night against the Yankees, he hit three home he runs. Three one to runs. left, one to right center, and one to right. But and I, it, go, go ahead. But I want you guys, the only time Dipper ever let me down, even when Ripken would try to beat me up <laughs> and hit me in the ribs, I would always have Dipsy there to say, hey, that's enough, leave Bear alone. We were in Texas. They locked, Dipper and Crowley locked me in the bathroom in Texas. Somehow with the garment bag, my garment bag, they locked me in the bathroom. They didn't come get me out. <laughs> I, heard you I missed the team bus and everything. That's the only time Dipper ever let me down. But I heard you took Rick Caracal Ripken, though, a little bit later on <laughs> oh, with some yeah. scissors, huh? <laughs> you know what? It was before we came back to play um, Milwaukee in that, that series. And um, I cut off all of Cal's uh, buttons on, on his shirt. shirt. Yep. Cut his tie in half. And to this day, I don't think he knew I did that. We both got roughed up by Cal. We both did. I had a mattress thrown on me, and he jumped on on top and just beat the heck out of you. He was too big, too strong, and had way too much energy for us, Bear. Demper, I roomed with him, and I had to take this beating every day. You know, I roomed with the man every day. Well, he day. was afraid of me because I took a hammer I wanted to hiding underneath the kitchen table. I said, if you come close, I'm going to hit you right on the toe. Oh, yeah. He knew I was crazy enough to do it. Anytime you're back, please visit. It with us. We always enjoy we it. gotta have the bear that. back, man. <laughs> Jeez. Come on, bear. Floyd Rayford used to play for the Orioles back in the 80s at third base.